you cannot please everyone. You can't, so don't even try. Can I tell you that I receive thousands of messages in social media from different groups, from different people, from different persuasions, and from different agendas. You know, I remember two weeks after the Jewish-Palestinian war in Gaza, I received two messages, one pro-Palestine and one, one pro-Jewish. You know, the, the, the first letter says, Brother Bo, it's not, it, it seems as though you're not concerned with the Palestinians who are dying in Gaza. And then there's this other message that I received, Brother Bo, why are you not praying for the Jews who are being murdered? And, and so you've got these two two letters. And then I receive other kinds of letters very often about, Brother Bo, you need to talk more about the rosary and, and teach people to pray the rosary every day. And, and then another message about, Brother Bo, you don't stand up against the government and the administration and the, the corruption. And you need to do that. You need to protest. You need to call people and point the evil that is happening. And then there's others who talk about, Brother Bo, why are you not talking about the poor farmers? And another message, Brother Bo, why are you not talking about the indigenous minorities? They need our help. And Brother Bo, why don't you talk about, and Brother Bo, and brother, brother, brother. <laughs> so I get flooded by all sorts of things and messages and saying that, you know, you need to do this. I want you to know that I read them and I do pray for them, all these messages. But at the end of the day, I go to God and I want to fulfill His expectations, not theirs. I want to answer His call not theirs, because God has given me a specific call. And for the past 40 plus years of doing ministry work, I have tried my best to listen to the Lord and say, Lord, what do you want me to do? And my answer to you, Lord, is yes, I will go to the people that you want me to. In our gospel for today, we have Jesus being rejected by his own hometown. And you know, what Jesus did, he made them irrelevant. When people reject you because you don't fit with their agenda and you don't fulfill their expectations, it's okay. Focus on saying yes to God, doing His agenda, and serving the people He has called you to serve. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Jesus, come. Thank you, Lord God, that you have called me to serve you. And so my answer to you is yes, Lord. I will serve you with the gifts that you have given me and serve the people you are sending me to. Thank you for the power. Thank you for the gifting. Thank you for the grace. Thank you for the blessings. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Elevate your full tank experience by becoming a full tank supporter. And as my way of saying thank you, you will receive Full Tank Saturday, Full Tank Sunday, plus other exclusive videos only for supporters. All you have to do is click the button subscribe here in Facebook or the button join in YouTube when you use a computer. Thank you so much for your kindness. God reward you for your generosity.